I'm Jess Roy and today I'm your personal chef. Alright, so today we're going to do a knife skills and I'm going to show you a couple different ways to peel and cut garlic. So, everybody kind of just thinks I'm just going to smash down my garlic and mash it all up. But half the time people don't even get the peel or what I like to call the garlic paper all the way off the garlic. So one way, yes, is to go ahead and crush your garlic. So I've got my garlic on my cutting board, the back of my knife with the palm of my hand, going to gently mash it down. So now that opens up the garlic to remove the outer skin. Next, I'm just going to take off the end of my onion, I mean, excuse me, my garlic, so that we don't get that into whatever we're cutting. And I'm gonna give it one more smash. Next, what I'm gonna do is turn this garlic into a paste. And all that means is I'm just gonna take my knife blade and run it down along the garlic. And really, what we're doing is releasing the juices of the garlic and we're kind of smashing it into that nice paste which you can then add into whatever recipe you need. And this gets like a really nice concentrated garlic flavor. So you just go ahead and continue to smash. And there's our garlic paste. Next, I'm going to show you a second way to go ahead and peel and chop your garlic. I'm going to take my knife to the core end, the root end of my garlic and place it down on the board. And then I'm going to roll my garlic over and hopefully remove one whole side of the wrapper. Got that discarded over there. Next, I can just break off from the tail end and in a final peel, grab just the last bits of garlic peel. Oh, getting a little resistance. There we go, it should come loosely off. That means it's a good, nice clove of garlic. Peel wants to stay right on there. Okay, next up, I'm just going to half my garlic so I get a flat edge. Some people like to remove the germ of the garlic. If there's a little green piece in here, go ahead and do that if you like. I'm just gonna leave it in. Next, I'm just gonna make an incision right through the center of my garlic, long ways. And then I'm going to cut down into slices, leaving the end on the garlic, cutting down again across the lines that I just made resulting in a nice little chop. All uniform, no mess on my cutting board. So I'll do it one more time. I'm gonna cut across and in, and then I'm going to cut down in lines, horizontal lines. And then I'm going to make one more cut perpendicular to the lines that I just made. And then I've got my nice, perfectly chopped garlic cloves. So there you go. There's a couple different ways to go ahead and chop up your garlic. I'm Jess Roy. We'll see you next time at Your Personal Chef. For more videos or for more recipes and more knife tips, please visit lolsun.com. See you later.